The Wilbur Company is an employee-owned company, about 285 employees worldwide. Uh, here in North America, we have a fabrication division. We build products for a large wheel loader for Caterpillar. We build products for complex fabrications for JLG. We're located in Orville, Ohio, so it's a very rural community. That's why automation is so important to us because headcount is a challenge. When we looked out over our five-year plan for growing fabrication, we knew that we needed to, to supplement with automation to grow those sales. Wilbur, like many companies, um, struggles with staffing, um, especially in the welding industry, there is a shortage of labor. Another challenge was that production time and being able to be efficient and competitive. We have a very high mix, low volume application that we're dealing with both in our machine shop and on the fabrication side. So it requires a lot of setup, it requires a lot of product specific knowledge. We have two different uh, FANUC cells that were integrated through uh, WeldBot, and we used FANUC touch sensing and through arc seam tracking. On the first system, we have the FANUC 710, 12L. You know, that's one of the largest reach robots out there, especially in the arc welding world. So that allowed us to reach a very large part work envelope. We have a headstock tailstock positioner on one side and we have a drop center two axis positioner on the other side. This allows flexibility um, from one side to the other. It allows them to run different varieties of parts just to help minimize downtime and increase production. On the second system, we put it on a FANUC servo driven track and this is different than the first system where we have a large stationary robot. The smaller robot being able to move around created some reach benefits on different product families and allowed them more throughput on a multitude of systems. Touch sensing is nice because they, we can have variations in the parts and the assemblies and so we can search that part and apply an offset to offset the program and then that way we know it starts in the joint every single time. And then from there, through arc seam tracking, takes over and it keeps the arc in the joint throughout the whole weld. This is the first time I've worked with a welding robot. It's definitely been a great learning experience. Every part comes out the same. It frees me up to do more of like the cleaning aspect um, where the robot can continually weld and I can clean up any spatter, but yet still keep producing product. I've been working with FANUC robots for over 20 years. They've just always proven to be extremely dependable. They've always been well supported on the technical side, and frankly, we've always just found them easy to interface with the software that you use for the offline programming. We use FANUC Weld Pro to uh, do all of our offline programming. It's an extremely valuable tool. I, I can't emphasize that enough. Um, it saves hundreds of hours of robot downtime. With Fanix Weld Pro software, as an integrator, we're able to fully vet and fully understand the application before we sell the equipment. We take pride in our engineering all the way through the implementation of the system. Um, our customers expect our systems to run flawlessly. They expect them to be very robust and very reliable. And that is why we use our FANUC arms, because they provide us with the service, the solution, the training um, that we need in order to be successful. The FANUC automation has allowed us to add more business to this facility. It helps us keep our overhead rates low and keep us competitive on a global scale because we're no longer just competing against people in northeastern United States. It really is a global uh, market that we're competing with and that automation has allowed us to stay competitive in that field.